it would not start with um, something I wanted to say. I would be I would be suspicious of doing that. I would be nervous of it, and I wouldn't trust that. I'll find out <laughs> as we go forward. And then you would try to understand the meaning of. Uh, I I'm not this sure what image. happens. It, it, I think it makes connections with other images and other sequences and other actions, and it starts to grow like that. I think you know if that person I mentioned who seemed to be very embarrassed about something in public, maybe they're um, like a young mother who is embarrassed by her child, you know, because children can be embarrassing and don't fit. And if she wants to, uh, maybe she wants to um, still be perceived as being a very young, unattached person, and yet she has this monster child who's throwing food around or, you know, doing this, 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 no, she would love that child, but at the same time she's embarrassed by that child. So already you see I'm making this scenario grow a little bit. So you, it, things like that, but then she becomes real. And then she starts to have a life and then we find out what's going on with her. So it would, it would grow like that. And then at some point you write down uh, the scenes that you want to see or the scenes that have to be. You don't write down the mistake as I think sometimes to start telling the story bit by bit, but I find it more interesting to just, oh, I really want this, this scene would be great, and I really want, and I'll write this scene. So you end up with a series of scenes like this that you, you want to see, you want to experience in some way. And by the time you're doing that, then there's a, a narrative is unfolding um, very quickly after that. <laughs>